Maria. Maria here from Really Maria. Material girl on lockdown in my lovely haberdashery. Completely lost the plot and I've made so many masks. Well, I'm sure so many of you have been making masks. I don't need this on. You can hear me now. So, what have I gone and done? Well, I've had one of those eureka moments. Masks. Now that we've all got these skills, what do we do with all these masks? How about turning them into a top, a little bikini top? Because we are all survivors. <laughs> and how is it done? It's so simple. And I don't know why I didn't think about it before, but you're all good at this by now. And you, I mean, you, these are just so, now that we're so professional at making these, let's turn them into a little top one. Okay, so you take your two masks, place them beside each other like that. Already you can see it's taking shape. You can sew down the middle, perhaps doing a zigzag stitch just to hold them together. Or as I would do, I quite like just placing them one on top of the other like that. Now you can pin these down if you like, but um, I'm quite lazy, I'm just going to go for it. So start sewing, going straight and then reverse. Give it a bit more stability and so your stitches won't open. You carry on going straight down. I've used white just so that you can see it's clearer. Then turn around, I'm going to catch this side now. Again, exactly like we did the other side. Go back and forward. Carry on right to the end. And when you've got there, reverse. And it's done. So there's the beginnings of your top. You can put a little bit of bling down the middle if you like, or you could do a fancy stitch. Now, how simple was that? Well, you finished sewing your top together. Already it's taken shape. When you've done that, here's one I made earlier. You place it on your mannequin. I'm going to show you in part two how to pip your top. So I'll see you then. Take care and be safe.